Hello, I'm Mike Clark. For 25 years, I lived in the grips of obsessive compulsive disorder, OCD. The journey was arduous, but after decades of struggle, I discovered a transformative approach that led to my recovery in just one month. Now I celebrate five years free from OCD, a milestone that once seemed unattainable. My experience has equipped me with invaluable insights into overcoming OCD. The most empowering realization? With the right techniques, recovery can happen much faster than you might believe, even in a matter of hours. I'm here to share these lessons and guide you on a path to understanding and curing OCD, potentially accelerating your journey to freedom. Understanding OCD Symptoms Obsessive Compulsive Disorder OCD, manifests in a multitude of ways, with symptoms that are as unique as the individuals experiencing them. However, there are common threads that tie these experiences together. Recognizing these symptoms is the first step towards empowerment and recovery. 1. Obsessive Thoughts These are the hallmark of OCD. These thoughts are intrusive and unwanted, often appearing without any apparent reason. They can be persistent and distressing, leading to significant emotional discomfort. Common themes include fears about contamination, harm, or needing things to be in perfect order. The intensity of these obsessions can be overwhelming, making it difficult to focus on daily tasks. 2. Compulsive Behaviors In response to these obsessive thoughts, individuals with OCD engage in compulsive behaviors. These are repetitive actions performed in an attempt to relieve the anxiety caused by the obsessions. These can include excessive cleaning, checking, counting, or arranging things in a particular way. While these actions might provide temporary relief, they often reinforce the OCD cycle. 3. Avoidance Avoidance behavior is another symptom of OCD. This involves steering clear of situations or objects that may trigger OCD symptoms. For instance, someone with a fear of germs might avoid public spaces or touching common surfaces. Avoidance can significantly restrict one's lifestyle and lead to a decrease in overall life satisfaction. 4. Heightened anxiety and stress. Living with constant obsessions and compulsions often leads to increased levels of anxiety and stress. This heightened state of mental tension is not just a symptom, but also a catalyst that exacerbates OCD. 4. The perpetual cycle of anxiety and compulsive behavior can be exhausting, affecting all aspects of life, from personal relationships to professional responsibilities. In my own journey, I've experienced the debilitating effects of these symptoms firsthand. But I also discovered that understanding these symptoms is a powerful step in taking control back from OCD. It's crucial to remember that these symptoms stem from the mind, not our true essence. By focusing on our divine self, we can begin to see these symptoms as separate from who we truly are, paving the way for recovery and peace. The root of OCD, anxiety. Understanding that anxiety forms the foundation of obsessive-compulsive disorder, OCD, is crucial in addressing the condition effectively. Anxiety in the context of OCD acts as both a trigger and a sustainer of the disorder, creating a self-perpetuating cycle that can be challenging to break. Anxiety, at its core, is a natural response of the mind to perceived threats or danger. It's an alarm system evolved to protect us. However, in OCD, this system becomes hyperactive and misfires, leading to a constant state of heightened alertness even in the absence of actual threats. This heightened state manifests as obsessive thoughts, which are the mind's way of trying to control or neutralize these perceived threats. What's important to understand is that this anxiety is not an inherent part of our being. It's a learned behavior. Just like learning to drive a car or play an instrument, our responses to anxiety are developed over time. In many cases, a significant stressful event or a series of such events can trigger the onset of OCD, leading the mind to adopt these anxiety-driven patterns as a coping mechanism. In my own experience, I've seen how this learned anxiety can take root and dictate one's life. However, I've also witnessed the power of unlearning these patterns. By recognizing that anxiety is a product of the mind and not a reflection of our true self, we can begin to disentangle ourselves from its grip. This realization is the first step towards retraining the mind and embracing the calm and joy that lies within our divine essence. As I embarked on my journey of recovery, it became clear that treating OCD isn't just about managing symptoms, it's about addressing the underlying anxiety. It's about understanding that while our minds may generate anxiety, our true essence is untouched by it. This shift in perspective is transformative, allowing us to approach OCD not as a lifelong burden, but as a condition that can be cured through mindful and spiritual practices. The Misconception of OCD Treatment 
There's a prevailing belief in both the medical community and general society that obsessive compulsive disorder, OCD, is an incurable condition, one that can be managed but never truly eradicated. This perception has shaped how individuals with OCD approach their recovery, often limiting their outlook to managing symptoms rather than seeking a complete cure. However, my personal experience stands as a testament to the contrary. For 25 years, OCD was a significant part of my life, a constant companion dictating my actions and clouding my thoughts. But my journey led me to an unexpected and transformative truth. OCD is not a life sentence, it can indeed be cured. The key to this revelation was understanding the nature of OCD and its root in anxiety. By recognizing that OCD is a learned response of the mind, a response that can be unlearned, I was able to embark on a path that led not just to the management of symptoms, but to complete freedom from OCD. This journey wasn't easy, but it was incredibly enlightening. It required a deep dive into the workings of my mind, an exploration of the spiritual aspect of my being and a steadfast commitment to change. Contrary to the years I spent living with OCD, the actual process of overcoming it once I found the right approach was astonishingly quick. Within a month, I had broken free from the chains of OCD that I once thought were unbreakable. My experience challenges the traditional view of OCD treatment. It shows that with the right understanding and tools, particularly those that emphasize mindfulness, connection with our inner essence, and a shift in perspective from mind to true self, complete recovery is not just a possibility, but an achievable reality. This realization is empowering and liberating. It opens up a new realm of hope for those struggling with OCD, offering a path that leads not just to coping, but to true healing. It's a journey from a life dictated by obsessive thoughts and compulsive behaviors to one of freedom, peace, and joy. Curing OCD, Mind versus Essence. The path to curing obsessive compulsive disorder, OCD, hinges on differentiating between our mind and our true essence. This understanding forms the cornerstone of the healing process. Our essence, which is our core being, remains undisturbed and peaceful, even amidst the chaos of obsessive thoughts and compulsive behaviors. This essence is naturally imbued with serenity and joy, a stark contrast to the turbulence typically experienced in the mind. Steps to Cure OCD 1. Acknowledge OCD Symptoms The first crucial step is to recognize and accept the symptoms of OCD. 1. It's about observing your obsessive thoughts and compulsive actions without judgment or criticism. Understanding these as symptoms of a condition, not as part of your identity, is vital. 2. Understand anxiety's nature. Anxiety, the driving force behind OCD, is a construct of the mind. It is important to recognize that these feelings of worry and fear are not an accurate reflection of your reality or your capabilities. Instead, they are the mind's response to perceived threats, often blown out of proportion. 3. Practice mindful awareness. Mindfulness is a powerful tool in the fight against OCD. This involves observing your thoughts and feelings with a sense of detachment. By practicing mindful awareness, you learn to view your thoughts as passing clouds, not as dictations that you must follow. 4. Stop reacting to compulsions. One of the most challenging yet crucial steps in overcoming OCD is resisting the urge to perform compulsive behaviors. Each time you don't react to these compulsions, you send a strong message to your mind that you are in control, weakening OCD's influence over time. 5. Faith and trust. Having faith in your inner strength and trusting in a higher power or your own resilience is essential. This trust helps to anchor you, providing strength and confidence as you navigate the ups and downs of recovery. Consistency is key. Consistent practice of these steps is essential for lasting change. It's a journey of small, steady steps rather than a sudden transformation. Each act of resistance, mindfulness, and trust in your true essence builds upon the last, leading to profound and sustainable healing. By embracing and practicing these steps, you can gradually dismantle the cycles of OCD. It's a journey that leads from a life dictated by anxiety and compulsions to one of freedom, inner peace, and joy. Remember, your essence is always there, a sanctuary of tranquility waiting for you to reconnect and rediscover the peace that has always been a part of you. Conclusion, a life beyond OCD. Overcoming OCD is a journey filled with challenges, but also immense hope and potential. As someone who has not only lived with OCD for 25 years, but also triumphed over it for the last five, I understand the path well. For more in-depth guidance, visit my YouTube channel, Mindful Journey to Joy, Mindful Journey to Joy, YouTube. Explore insightful content on my blog at cureocd.org. 
and discover comprehensive strategies through my courses at mindfuljourneytojoy.com. Together, we can turn the page on OCD, transforming it from a debilitating condition to a journey toward peace, joy, and true freedom.